Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. We've been talking about the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam and giving some of the hadith or teachings that he has. We find in the Quran how to have the best of manners even in the face of the harshest of people. And I want to explain something to you before we get into this. There's something called the Bedu or Bedouins. What are the Bedouins? These are people who live in the desert. They have a very harsh life and uh, the sun is beating down on them and at night it gets so cold and they have difficulties in finding water. So they have a harsh life and they have harsh treatment for each other, and they have harsh language that they use, and they're kind of borderline insulting, <laughs> if you know what I mean. But Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala takes that into consideration because he knows what he created after all, and he's telling the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam how to respond to these people. In the Quran, in the translation of this, and this is from chapter 9, which is the only surah that does not have basmalah, the basmala on it. Anyway, it's verse number 97, and Allah is say, this is the translation of the meaning. The people of the desert, okay, the Bedouins, are strong in their kufr, their disbelief, and hypocrisy, nifaq, and more likely not to know the limits of the laws of Allah revealed to the messenger. So here is Allah telling the Prophet wasalam, about his own people and that they are <laughs> the most likely to be stronger in disbelief, stronger in hypocrisy, and stronger in not knowing what the limits are. Okay, so how should I react to them? And this is coming in chapter 3, Surah Al-Imran, and number Hadith, uh, sorry, this is the ayah number, 159. The Prophet of Allah, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, reacted to the harshness of these desert people with forbearance and mercy. And Allah talks about that in the Quran in Surah Al-Imran, verse 159. He said, and this is a translation of it, so by the rahmah of Allah, the mercy of Allah, you were lenient with them, and if you had been rude to them or harsh with them, then they would have cut you off and abandoned you. And that's what we should be doing now. Rely on Allah. Allahumma ya Rabb, I ask you, and I rely on you to guide me to what is better. Amen. Amen.